I found every fish in LEGO Fortnite. My goal on day one of the new LEGO Fortnite update was to catch every fish, and I did. Yes, even the elusive Vendetta fish. I spent some time getting to know the new food processor, and uses for the juicer to make bait pails, and I made myself a few epic fishing rods from Frost Pine Rods, then set off to explore the lakes and oceans of my LEGO Fortnite world. I just posted a separate video that's a full guide to the new items and lots of strategies and tips. There are 15 fish to catch, and here's where I found them, where you will also likely find them, and what you'll get from each if you feed them into the food processor. You're going to find a lot of orange floppers everywhere. You'll get two fillets from the common rarity ones. The legendary will give you five fillets, but keep it because Epic has hinted you'll have a way to display the legendary fish soon. Blue floppers are common rarity, but the rarest I've found on the shore during the day and they'll give you two fillets. You'll also get the wave break charm when you catch the first one. Green floppers are common and I found mine in frost, grass, and dry valley lakes during the day, but you may also find them at night. They give you two fillets. The Vendetta flopper is of epic rarity and can only be found in the grassland caves. You'll unlock the reflection charm recipe when you grab one. I posted a short on TikTok and YouTube that has all the details you need to reel in a stack of these. They yield two fillets and two blast powder. The legendary will give you five fillets and five glass powder, but save it. The black and blue shieldfish is uncommon rarity and found in the grassland and dry valley shores, day or night. They yield two fillets and one uncommon shield. The purple thermal fish is uncommon rarity and found in the dry valley at night. They yield two bright core and one fillet. The raven thermal fish is uncommon rarity and I find mostly in the dry valley and mostly at night, but you should be able to find them in grassland shores and even during the day. They yield two bright core and one fillet. The silver thermal fish is uncommon rarity and I've only found in the frost lakes, mostly in evenings. They yield one frost shell plus two bright cores and one fillet. Blue slurped fish are rare rarity and found in the grasslands, including inside the caves, day or night. They yield two slurps and one fillet. The purple slurped fish are rare rarity, can be found in the grasslands and frost lakes anytime, and yield two slurp juices and one fillet. The yellow slurp fish are rare rarity, can be found in the dry valley anytime, and yield two slurp juices and one fillet. The blue small fry are uncommon rarity, found in any water and likely any time of day, and yield one fillet. The cuddle jellyfish are common rarity, found in any water, and likely any time of day. They yield three slurp juice. The slurp jellyfish are uncommon rarity, found on the shores day or night, and yield three slurp juices. The legendary will yield eight slurp juices in the food processor. The molten spicy fish are rare rarity found in the dry valley at night and yield one blast core and one fillet. The legendary fish are found anywhere you find the regular versions of the same fish. I used epic bait buckets and an epic fishing rod for all my fishing the first day, but you'll be able to find most of these with any rod and the rare and epic fishing circles can be found in the wild as you're exploring, so the bait buckets aren't required. Good luck catching them all. Check out our full walkthrough videos for the step-by-step -step to get this and so much more on LEGO Fortnite. Please hit the like button and subscribe if you want to see more videos about LEGO Fortnite. Uh.